to score before the end of the half. Down low, Jordan, nice move there, but can't get the shot to go. King again on the glass. Ooh. Here. Jayla Jordan, great post up, great post move. Attacks the smaller defender, Leah Two King, comes skying in, gets the and one. West Virginia is doing an extremely incredible job with on ball pressure, but they're leaving that high post wide open. As you see, Leah Two King giving Mountaineers a little bit of taste of their own medicine, getting out. Washington drives, looking out to King. King driving to the basket, a spin move, and it's in. An open player, and I think Pitt needs to kind of do the same on offense in their end. Lawrence driving, trying to go down low with Blackstone. Can't find her, though, and Pitt goes the other way with numbers. Malcolm in transition. Nice. Layup is good. And that's what we need to see. This Pitt team's been strong underneath the boards as we see Leah Two King take it strong and grab the and one. The rebounding has been the forward play. And you like to see there Iadel being strong underneath the basket. He's only played 15 minutes. Long two there misses from Jenkins. And as Malcolm it comes down with the rebound and Pitt goes the other way down eight. Inside King really nice passing there from the Panthers. She has been an All-American at every level she has played at so far. And now challenging herself at this level, and a steal. Leah Two King trying to draw the foul. Her left-handed layup is more up. than her points. She averages more rebounds a game than she does points. Washington gets it down low. King, good look, and there is Iodell. Great. She takes an off-balance shot. As you see there, great extra pass by King. Nine points so far for Wanser. We're barely halfway through the first quarter of play. King down low. Again, she gets physical, and again, she's to the line. In quarter number four, and they need to get something going offensively if they want to pull off the upset on the road. King through contact, goes to the line again. Corner triple off target. Panthers racing the other way with battle, and the dish off to King at the buzzer. It goes, and the Panthers make it a two-possession game at the end of the third. So plenty of offense in the Peterson Events Center today. Emerson down low, nice entry pass into lead to King. Can't finish. King gets the offensive rebound, puts it up. And how about the Panthers' opportunity for back-to-back -back three point plays? Transition, push the basketball. Jasmine Timerson finds Leah Two King through three players. Leah Two King goes up, misses, but is dominant on that offensive glass. Another player who stepped up huge as a freshman. There's King with momentum and a pair. Yeah, King showed you how physical she was. And Notre Dame has still, they've gotten some good looks. Oh, but there you see, Swiper. Oh, and Leah to King with the great hustle from behind. She made up for it with her effort and her hustle. Hidalgo's definitely going to get her hands on a lot of balls, but King. King. Extra pass inside, and it rolls around the rim. As Leah Tukin able to get the steal and the bucket, so that's another different way that she can get on the board. And that's on the other side, excuse me, for Georgia Tech, just understanding what they have to do on the three-point line. And we've seen Lusinate, who's been able to knock it down. We've seen also Kiritun knock down a triple as well. As Malcolm looks to respond with the three of her own, Great combination, and what a, uh, a great accomplishment that has been. Leah Two King fouled and the basket, and a good start for Pitt out of the called timeout. Wagner, you know that trip is always going to be a call on the defense. Leah Two King, another and one, her second in the last two minutes of this game. Apparently, Sanaya likes to cook it for the teammates, but Coach Jack has yet to try this famous gumbo recipe. Drive in by King, splits defenders and scores. Having the awareness to understand they're going to pass that ball out to the corner. Marley into King, 15 to shoot. King's going to spin in the lane. Three people guarding her, it doesn't matter. That Pitt is actually pressing their ball pressure, making those passes harder than usual. King holds on to it and lays it in. There was a lot of pressure swarming her, but it didn't matter. Even going up against very aggressive defenses, right? Tough shot there for Malcolm with a Desanoyan running right at her. Another giveaway. Perkins long two. Yes! Pitt hey. coming alive right now. 22 to 6. The edge for Pitt after halftime. 
Beautiful. Ivo pass. Jordan, layup, no. Stick back in for King at the horn. Picked off here by King. Trying to get out in transition and flipped it in. Almost seven minutes of this contest. Here's King, guarded by Russell. Stan Belolo comes to double. And a nice pass out of the post from King to Jordan. See right here, Curry's just watching the ball. She did, Jaquela Jordan did an excellent job cutting to the basket. And back and forth they go. King now looking for the pass. She's got it. Goes up and one. Leah to King taking a trip to the line to make it a three-point play. Potentially unintentional. <laughs> Nonetheless, Richardson okay. got the shot. King with the shot. It's in. Sometimes that extra couple inches just going to be able to do that for you. Quick steal, though, by Leah to King. Is she going to put it up or are they going to count it? It looks like they counted the it. Like for Leah to King. Oh, yeah. I think and it's close. Yeah. Jefferson being given all kinds of room. Marley Washington's passing back out to Malcolm. Hidalgo on King, who spins, takes a contested shot and makes it. User like they are right now. Tori Verdi wants her to take as many shots as she can. Maddie Westbell just getting cleaned up. There's some blood on the court. A block from King. Wow, what a block. Yeah, with authority there against Watson. Mentioned Florida State with 10 consecutive NCAA tournament trips there. One of eight schools in the country to reach 10 NCAA tournament. What Florida State has built as Leah Two King gets another bucket on the inside. She's just wide open, and that's too easy of a look for her. She's going to knock it down every time. Leah Two King to the rack. That's a good face to face. Yeah, just look at that step. Yeah, she saw the match up there against the freshman. She said, come on, freshman, I'll show you. In the hands of Malcolm. Malcolm, five seconds on the shot clock, might have to force one. King had the shot, got a better shot, and makes it. It is what you want to see. Take some pressure off of Leah, too. The more she can have people around her contributing, the more... Th what are I love her. She's just one of my favorite players to watch. She has two fouls. She goes for the steal. She goes coast to coast and finishes for the layup. Likely. Back out there after a bit of a breather. And Naya Valentine. Whitehorn trying to fight through the screen. King takes it away. Gets the handle, but lost the fast break. Yeah, we talk a lot about her offense and her rebounding, but she is a good defender. She does get blocked. To end the second quarter, just five to shoot. Jalen Jordan hasn't looked up at the clock yet. Three to shoot. Gets it down low to Leah Two King. One to shoot. Puts up a prayer oh. and banks it in. When it's your day, it's your day. Leah Two King, she has 11 points on the day. Shot clock running down. Jordan working back down low to King now in the paint. And she looks for some space. Man, what a nice move down low from her. She is so good down there in the place. King looking to get Pitt back on the score sheet here in quarter number two, and she just does just that. She's knowing that she didn't have much time getting that ball across the court and finding Wooly wide open. And this Pitt lineup has been pretty consistent throughout. Lead to King for points of the day, counted and won. Embracing contact, as you see on the replay, working along the baseline and just getting a little bit of contact. Time winding down in the third. Coming out of the timeout, first possession for Syracuse is a turnover. Really back on defense with battle. The left hand layup somehow falls. King with a step through and scores. She had a lot of company and somehow found her way to the left side of the rim. So 14 for Patrick. And now kicking things off in quarter number two. With Jasmine Thomas, I'm Joe Malfa. A nine-point lead for Boston College after a strong closing kick for the first quarter and a good response to begin the second. In, gets it over to Johnson. Baseline jumper. Rebounded by Perkins. Running the floor down the floor. Aislinn Malcolm, nice pass on time. Montar 